So Daily Wire has announced that they're coming out with a chocolate bar to compete with Hershey. But before we get any further into the video, I want to ask you guys, please like, share, comment, and subscribe. All these things help our channel a lot because we've been banned off a lot of other stuff. So Daily Wire has announced their new chocolate bar, her, uh, she, her, and he, him. And they said one has nuts and it's up, you, you know which one, right? Ha ha ha. And look, Hershey's been doing things, m and uh, Mars, Mars Candy uh, Candy Company, they've been doing stuff with wokeism, putting new spokespersons, but, you know, they, uh, everybody can have their chance to push their agenda. But my thing is, is like, the Daily Wire, they're taking advantage, they're grifting off of you. You know the YouTubers that, like, believe what they say, or about what they, they talk about. Daily Wire is not one of those people. Period. Period. They are not. They only try to make money. Their whole objective is to make money. Look in the history of the individuals that run and make made this company. It's not ideological. I mean, there's a tinge of it, but it's not something that they hold firm in. Their loyalty is to the almighty dollar, not to the almighty Lord. And they have this illusion to keep you trapped, right? Like this is the this is the facts of what we're dealing with, is that they want us to be bound in this this illusion, this matrix. We are trapped in a matrix, not to be all entertained about it, but we, we are trapped in, a, in like a weird permeated layer that is obscuring our vision to what reality and truth is. So now we've created this like augmented, it's really augmented reality, but we just can't see it yet. But eventually the technology will come into place and you'll be able to see it, but when you're ready to accept it. See, this is the illusion, the trap, the, the mind games that they're playing with us. We've got to step out of this world they've created for Our name is Little Eden. God created a perfect place called Eden. We ruined it. Like we made it where we could no longer enter. And then we had to toil in this part of the world. Uh, Eden was uh, intentionally made to be spread across the whole world. But man fell out of place. This is what Jesus repaired when he came to die for our sins. So that when we give ourselves to him, when we interact, that we'd spread this kingdom. It's not about making money. I've put cash tags on here. But you see me, I'm not grinding in the way to like serve wealth and man. I'm not going to put it on this one. I haven't put it in a while because it's like, what's the point? The real reality of what we're doing is to make a difference. Be a part of the preaching the gospel, like planting the seed, or maybe we're meant to, to tend to one for a while. Like we don't know, but we want to be about his work and don't want to get in the way. I always say that because I'm warning you of individuals that are doing that. And I don't want things to be misseen or misviewed because we care about you. We love you guys. We do these videos because we love you. I might not have been as consistent lately. And we could talk about that another time. But guys, we love you. I turn this camera on because I know these things need to be said in a way that they're not being said. Something that's scripturally based. Something that's viewed from the lens of God. So I guess all I can say at this point is thank you guys again for joining. We love you. We enjoy all of your comments, everything. We really love it. And we're just going to leave you with this. Come with me and you'll be world of your imagination. What you'll find.